Hey boys, how are you doing today? Good. All right, I got a new game for you guys today. You ready for this? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now I think you're both gonna like this game, okay? okay? This is not necessarily one of my favorites or anything because it's brand new, but I've been watching this game in development uh, for a long time. And this game is called Hob. See this guy here? Yeah. It's a robot. No, he's not a robot. Really? Why is he metallic and have a gigantic fist made out of stone? Well, that is a very good question and one I can actually answer. Oh, okay. Sweet. I started this game as this character and I was kind of like in a maybe a cave or a jail cell. It's hard to say. You see this world here? There's some natural parts of the world, but there's some of the stone parts, right? Mm -hmm. I was kind of locked up in this robot creature came and opened the door and he let me out and I started following him and he punched through some walls and he pulled some blocks around and I was playing with the butterflies and I got close to something that was purple not like this purple stuff over here to my right but a little more purplier and when I got too close it grabbed my arm and I yanked my arm away and it must have been painful because the guy fell on the ground and he was grabbing his arm and his arm started to get these purple dots on it and our little robot guy that is not on the screen right now came by he's a bit bigger than i am and he chopped off my arm he chopped off my arm which was uh obviously poisoned and it was probably going to kill me and he chopped off my arm and he took me to some place and he ripped his arm off and he, uh, when I woke up, I had my his arm on. So you see this arm of mine? Mm -hmm. That's his arm, but he put it on my body. Now that was the whole fistery. Why are you, you also a robot? Why well, I am not a robot, as yeah. far as I can tell. Why do you look metallic? I don't think I look metallic. Your face kind of looks metallic. Uh, maybe it is. Well, the, uh, I know nothing else about this game. Like, this game does not tell you anything. It is an explore exploring based adventure game with some uh, Zelda some fighting kind of like portal knights in it okay so I have this sword I finally got a sword but I didn't have that at the beginning and uh, it's there is no text there is no English the robot talks to me kind of in a language I can't understand well maybe it's like no man's sky where you can understand your no language by you over time. no there's nothing that allows me to learn the language it's very just kind of he kind of shows you what to do kind of you do it you just kind of have to learn okay so it's it can be frustrating in the beginning for maybe somebody like you because you've not had a lot of experience with games like this maybe it's very puzzle based but i think you would probably figure it out you just have to be patient and you have to be willing to go back and forth okay now i am about to enter this new area that i found i'm not even sure i need to enter this area i don't even know if that's what i'm supposed to do there's nothing that really tells me that I need to do that. I've just been kind of like exploring and I don't think I can do anything else. If I look at my map, which I just got, the robot guy just gave me this map, okay. Um, whoops, that's not the map. There we go. I'm going to pan out a little bit. See that blinking thing up there? Yeah. He pointed to that and then he pointed to some other big metallic platform things and he pointed to something in the ground that looks like it's um i don't know something needed to be turned on okay so i kind of first thought he meant i needed to turn these things on so i could get to that spot but now i think he means i need to get to that spot so i can turn on those things all right mm -hmm. so i don't know but i'm going this way hoping i get to that spot that's kind of my goal now on the left hand side i don't really know what many of those symbols mean i know in the top i have a health bar okay and the third one down there on the left side, I found out how to get an extra health bar uh, marking, and that is through finding certain things in the world, okay? There's also... Mana? Yeah, so over here, you can see this is the icon of where my robot guy is. He's over here, I think. And there's also like a home base I have where I can upgrade things. Uh, if I scroll over, I don't know what those symbols on the left mean i don't know what those symbols in the middle mean the ones in the middle though i think are pieces to my sword i find these like creatures that look like me in the world that are kind of already dead and they have a sword in the ground 
And if I get that sword, I think I get a piece of a sword that I can do. And I also have a sprite cloak, which I don't know how to put on or activate. Maybe it's that thing you have on right now. It might be, but it says I'm weaker. Let's see, it says boost speed but reduces health and energy. I don't see my health getting reduced. <gasps> and see how it says 62? That's sort of like my currency. I can use that to upgrade my moves. It looks like you have some fan. Yeah, I don't know what that is, but that I have one. That might be some, like, some sort of special coin that you can use to buy very high advanced level stuff. Yeah. Alright, so this game, again, was called Hob, and it's out now. It came out today. Um, this will go up tomorrow, but this the game came out today, so I've only had, like, a couple hours with it. And it's on the PS4, and I believe it's on Steam as well. But it's a PS4 game, at least, um, for sure. So, I'm getting ready now. Let's go in this new section. I see thunder in here and lightning. That's new. So, I don't know what kind of challenges that's going to bring, but we're just going to explore. See this thing right here? Mm -hmm. This is like a save point. When I find one of those, that's it kind of automatically saves it. Now, my sword here can cut, cut the grass. I wonder where you can and find that's, grass. You know, we can fight some enemies. Uh, obviously, if I jump off that, I'll probably die. Oh, I almost got hit that by lightning. Like you see that? That looks like some sort of giant... Mm -hmm. Well, it's... Uh, th okay, I... here's the thing. Oh, yeah, my special moves I have so far. Mm -hmm. So I can hold... Um, I can... No, I can't do it right now. Okay, if I hold one the triangle button, I can charge up this, like, punch. And there are certain things I can punch. Now, what's this? I think I can go in there. Save one. Uh, this might be this might be like a teleporter or it's not a save point. I don't know what this is. Can I go to the other one over there? I might have just teleported to the other one. That'd be cool. Hey, what is Because then I could guys? show you the home base stuff. Uh, more creatures of this world. You seen them yet? So cute. yeah, I think that was a teleporter, guys. So I think I'm back now. See this hole in the wall? I busted that with my punch like this you can break through holes here's my robot guy so here's where I am now and this is where he showed me that part there and told me that like see that big metallic looking thing out there no. uh, let me get up here whoops oh, I just killed myself all right oops one one too many jumps so it's going to respawn me now back in the other area, I think. But we're learning. Yep. Back in this world. At least you know where the teleporter is. Yeah. We can just teleport back. Which is great. I wanted to do that anyway. I didn't want to have to walk all the way back. This game has a like an overworld kind of like Zelda, you know? But also, mm -hmm. it it's like a really metallic world. So it you can kind of change its shape when you hit certain buttons things move and the entire world moves like it's all made out of like gears you can kind of see how this is a gear it just it's I really can't strange see how the bushes are gears no the they're not but see how the walls around it kind of are like they'll it's this orange stuff around here you do certain things and it'll move all right so let me go show you this again and hopefully i won't fall off this time so see standing here does nothing but eventually it will and see that thing out there yeah I, that weird tall yeah. statue yeah so he made some gesture toward those like something will happen i think he the only way for him to cross it is if i go over there and see this this is the circuitry thing i was talking about he also pointed to this doing something to this block maybe unlocking it punch it i can't nothing happens when i punch it i swear that would have done yeah Can see this was it? a button like this looks like a punch. I punched through here, and this is where I went, and I got an upgrade in this area, I think. Or was this a place I had to explore? Yeah, no, I came out of this area. So it's it's you got to backtrack a lot, and there's lots of things to do. I'm trying to uh, I need to find my home cave kind of thing, where my upgrades are. I want to show you that, and I also want to get some upgrades because I've a lot of money. I think it's this one. 
Yeah, let's go in here. Yeah, so this is the workshop area, and this has three places right now I can do upgrades. This first one here, you can walk in, and it doesn't do anything yet. So there looks oh. like there's other hobs I could get, but I don't know what those are. I can't. Maybe their fists are different. Maybe. Maybe it's like a loadout of some kind. Um, here, this is what I really want to use. You stick your fist in this machine. Oh, and you can upgrade it. Oh, now the sprite cloak is there. So it's actually going to cost me 100 of those green things and 8 of the fan things. Wow. I'm not going to be able to unlock that for a while. But I could do sword combo, a third more powerful combo attack. This Mechanical is kind of like shield. this is like your Y button attack in Skylanders. Your like third attack that you buy. So I'm going to buy this. Okay, also buy the mechanical shield. Agility. I want I, agility. Because I bought that though, I can't buy the sword thrust. Uh, improved rolling dodge. Or but if you buy mechanical that, shield. I want the mechanical shield. Well, buddy, in your game, you buy the mechanical shield, okay? I kind of am with Elias. I think I'd rather do a better dodge, okay? I'm not doing much with the shield, but that does sound interesting. I just, I only have 40 left. 42. Do you get those things from fighting monsters? You do. You Can get I... them from finding monsters, but you also get them from finding, like, treasure boxes. Because I want to see some monsters. There isn't that much off. fighting right now. There is some, but it's mostly exploring. And now here, I don't know if I can do anything. I have pieces of a sword. See, I dropped it in there. And it, and it filled it up tank. a little, but not a lot. So I don't know what that does. I think, I think it makes I my sword bigger. No. I'm going to guess it makes my sword bigger and stronger. No, this is what I think. Okay. Kind of like what you're saying. If you fill that up, it, does, it engulfs your sword and gives you a brand new, longer, stronger sword. Yeah, that's kind of what I was going for. Improving it. But we'll see. I, I we got to find more Those stuff. Those are cute. I, really I think they're size. bad. I think anything with black in them has been bad. There are animals that won't hurt you, but... And big, tall, giraffe-looking things. Oh, I Maybe want, I can I find like one cute? real quick. Because I, I they're really kinda like giraffe -looking See, look, there, there's one. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, wait. Oh. He would be... He's cute. He's, he's still cute. He's kind of cute, I guess. Like, nice. he, won't, he won't hurt me. I probably could him? kill him, but I, I haven't attacked that one yet because he's pretty big. Yeah, and he's cute. Another one. So some of these guys, they roam around. Punch, a, punch something through that wall. I saw a closed wall. You saw a closed wall? See that? Oh. No, I already did that one. I've already explored most of this area, which is why I'm pretty sure I need to be going where I was. See this tree right here? That is like a dead tree or something. You can cut that one up. But there's nothing around it. I swear that has to do something. Why would they put a random dead tree there? Well, see, these holes, these were trees here. I was just clearing out the area. I think the grass grows back. But now there is stuff back. This is kind of toward where I began the game. There is stuff back there which I don't know what to do with yet. Punch it. No, punching doesn't work. Like this right here, does this do anything? I don't know. There's just places that... I may have to go back to. So there might be a lot of backtracking in this game. That's the purple stuff that took my arm. Can you fight it? No, and it probably will kill you if you try to uh, go in it. do it. This is um, one of the first blocks. Now that I have this hand, I can pull this block around. Ah, uh, it looks like pull the block and put it in there. No, that's where it came from. Oh. Okay, I had to get it out of there to put it in here. So get I get up there. Yeah. Okay, All right. first thing I would do in this game, if I find anything suspicious except that purple stuff, just punch it. Yeah, and I have been. And that's why I'm telling you most of the stuff doesn't do anything. It's not working. All right, so let's get back in our teleporter. But never stop punching. And go back to the new area because see the map? I pretty much unlocked except for some... Yeah, I don't think I can go to the right anymore, but maybe there's some place to the right of where I, I am. I see some sort of circle-ish thing to the right. I don't, know if mm, I don't know. And there's this weird rectangle. Yeah, I saw this little circle glowing. Oh, yeah, I saw that too. Well, I, 
I probably know what those are or have been there or I can't do anything with them yet. So. No, they were on your map. They were on a different part you haven't explored yet. Oh. Okay, well, let's explore this area, all right? So this is what I think. Some giant mechanical beast or some electric guy is controlling all this. Okay, you know what? You don't even need to think or worry about that much, okay? It's a mystery you're going to find out by playing. Okay? Yeah, you, ha you guess mysteries. Right. But hey, you don't need to guess it right now. Do you okay? punch that hole? Nope. You need to watch. Bye, guy. Okay, you distracted me. Okay, there's a lot of crabs. They're not crabs. I don't know what they are. They're just a bad guy. Okay. Crabs. There's a hole in the ground here. Don't I, fall through. I it. don't think I want to fall in that. So there's something. I think I can climb up this maybe. Yep. But I can't do anything with it. it it'll give me. Um, it usually okay. gives me like a button press if I was supposed to do anything. But see how this kind of is. Try punching it. Yes. Did you not just see me do that? No. Okay. Well, I did. I saw you. I saw you try to hit it with his sword. Punching it is not gonna work. Okay. I just told you. When it wants you to do something with it, it tells you to hit a button. Okay? No button prompt showed up. These guys are not easy to beat. You can't just, you kind of have to learn their movement. Now, I got an improved dodge. Is that it? Because it's not very, it doesn't seem very awesome. There is like blood like that. You see that blood? Yeah, it's you, not that bad. You can turn that off if you want in the options. How huh, sweet. So this so clearly oh. I can't go this way yet. Huh. I feel like that has to do something with this. I might need to go down there. It looks like there's a platform under there. Should I try it? Yeah, sure. All right. Because this Before game is all about exploring. Oh, yep. There we go. Look, now you're under the thing. Right. This world is a very mechanically strange world. Oh, no. But nothing down here. What? Whoa. I almost fell off. Try climbing up there. Yeah, I bet that just takes me back out. I'm just trying to... It may take you to a new area. I might, but see, I, but I don't want to go that way. I want to go this way. Whoop. Okay. So, the bad thing about this game is the camera angles are sometimes hard to judge. You don't... You can't move the camera around. It's... The camera angle is what it gives you. Now, I want to jump to the other side there. Like that. Then... Whoa. And then here, this is the treasure chest thing I was telling you about. Hey, those are the green things. Yep, it gave me about 10 of them. Hey, now you can have the um, shield. Yeah. I could, but I'm not going to go back just to get that. I'm just going to keep going. All right, so that is at least one thing down here. Now, maybe if I turn that thing in the middle or do something to it, it it's going to lower and I'll be able to go deeper into this cavern but for now it looks like that's all I can do or maybe you do something with that thing which makes that top thing pressable maybe like I'm sure that was this thing right here but yeah but there's no power to this I think I, you know I can punch it I can do whatever but see it's not telling me to do anything I think, see this, he was pointing to these lines. These are like power lines. And I think show you where they go? if I connect certain stuff, I might be able to turn those things on somehow. Um, here's a, whoop, well, I got to fight. Oh, I walked right into that. They give me a couple of health and then a couple of those, uh, sometimes they give you the green money stuff. Now, I see, here's a door I can't get through. Yeah, I can try to punch it, but it won't do anything. That saps all my energy every time I do that. Now, see that above? That's a punch button above. See that? So you punch that button. Yeah, that'll make... That'll turn this into a ladder I can climb. But it won't do it until I get up oh, there. I thought that would open the door. All right, so there's something I probably don't want to touch. That thing looks like it's making the thunder. Whoa, what's that thing? I don't know. 
definitely don't want to go in that. Wait a minute, it looks like you could fall through a certain spot, not hit the cog, and you'd be fine. Yeah, it doesn't, like this it's, doesn't tell me enough that makes me think I can do that. Uh, what I it seem to need, block. yeah, is a block so I can jump up there. This sounds like a puzzle game. Now, is this the same, or can I go through it? Try crawling. No, I can't crawl. I just saw you sneak down there somehow. Nope. I don't have any ability like that right now. Hmm. So here I am. This is kind of part of, this is where the game, you kind of get stuck a little bit. Like, there's a ladder. Oh, that's the Is that the ladder I came out of? Yeah. Oh, then maybe I should have stayed up there. Let's do it again. Yeah. Sometimes you can only get to certain areas one way. And then once you fall down, you won't be able to get back up. Unless you do. And there's another ladder across the way. Maybe I just have to go down another ladder. Yeah, so make sure I explore this area. Don't fall back down there. Stay up here. Yep, well, there's that, that ladder. Now that looks like a dead version of my robot friend. I've not seen one of those before. You see how it tells me a button press? That tells me I can do something there. So let's see. This looks like the dead versions of me where I get swords, sword pieces from. Maybe I'll get something like that from him. Or maybe you get stampies. I punched it. And I pulled out like it's heart. So whatever that symbol is, uh, it looks like an energy symbol. Okay, so looks like these guys. Did you see what happened? Yeah, you ripped There's, out. My arms. blue bar is an energy bar. Mm -hmm. I have one piece of those heart cog things I ripped out. It looks like if I get one, two, three, four, five of them, I'll increase my energy bar because the heart piece above it, those come from the guys that look like me that are dead. And when I find two of those. No, actually, they, I'm wrong. Those come from these weird plant hearts that I got. But when I get two of those, I get a, another red square. And I think cactus is in the way. I could try to punch this, but nope. Hey, there's, hey, no there's, some, there's a hole. I know. I want to get to that hole, right? No, but I can't. that hole. Yeah, with the, with the ladder? No, that hole. There's a hole on the ground. I'm just trying. Oh, I see. Yeah, okay. Try to punch you. Was I down here before already? Is this new place? It's new. You can do something with it. Yeah, I know. I can punch through that. You're right. I did, but that may lead before you to I do that, that I, okay, so this is the area I was before, but you're right. That is a new path out of here. I found that first, but I didn't want to tell him. Well, you got to speak up when you see something like that, bud. So if you jump and press. The punch button. Hey, now you're on the through. other side of the thing that did. Yep. That. Now I'm gonna get my. Oh no, that's not what that is. What is that? That's a fist. Something. Oh wow, new puzzle type thing. Now bring it over to the other pod. Not that. Yep. Not, not, not that. That thing. That I, thing. I know. I'm just trying to go this way. I'm trying to see where I can go. See the camera. It doesn't. There is no place over there. All right. Put in that. And more of the world. That Open. looks like one of those things that will bring you up. What just happened? These red light thingies appeared. Yeah. Oh, look what else happened. These things got turned on. So I found... You just activated a power cord. I did. I activated some sort of power cord. Now see, my guy can disappear off the screen. And like... I, there's never been a really a secret over there, but if that wall had a crack in it, I could go through it. All right, nothing else in here, it looks like. Except for that pod. But yeah, we gotta follow the power and see what happens. That, that's gonna open that door. Yep. Yeah. Looks like that'll open a gate. Definitely. Yep. It do it. Do it. Do it. I said that first. I knew it. Yeah, it's, that was not very that hard. But you. that's how you learn things in this game. They don't tell you. You just do. And you figure out. You do what you, what you think. Okay, now some bad guys here. Those are new. Nope. Oh, nope. They're just a, Okay, that's new. And he's a bad guy. Oh, wait, where is he? 
He's a bad guy. Well, yeah, he's a bad guy, and... I found his weakness. No, first look, I gotta... he rolls. No, look what he... He has time after he rolls. And don't hit him by the back. He's got a shell. Yeah, I know. I gotta oh, get to broke. his front. Well, what's my third attack? Well, he's got purple. Blood. So I got yeah. He hey, purple. drop. So he gave me some of that money stuff. Well, now this one's on over here. Can I climb this? Nope. Hey, good thing. See, like this one's on here, but this one over here is not on. Do I have to go up there and do something? Yeah, go. Can I walk on this? Nope. Don't Ow. walk on that. Well, follow the power. Follow the power. Oh, there's something in the ground there. Punch! But see, it didn't tell me to do it so. with the button press, so it's probably not. And here's oh, another. Oh, there's another card, that thing that leads to that. Yep. Maybe that will rot. Oh, purple goo, purple goo. And another one that, guys. Oh. You can't attack him until the shell breaks. Shell won't break unless he runs into something. He ran into something twice now. Maybe it takes. You're gonna. So if that was three times, let's see. Do I have to electrocute him? He ran into that. I thought I could get him. His shell, shell broke. I don't remember. His shell broke. I didn't a remember that. His shell broke a little. Yeah. Well, let's get him into the wall again. Or how about this? That looks kind of sharp, maybe. Oh, you hear that, that noise? Yeah, that that definitely was. Right. Oh wait, that guy's not killing. Him. There it is. Yeah. No, that he's dead. He's the other one I killed. Why is his body going? Because it's he's dead. I don't know. This, they and don't do you just realize disappear these guys have purple blood, not the red blood? It doesn't matter. There's all kinds of different color blood, I think, from these guys. Alright, so don't go I'm dying, but. I need... Go that way. I see the, the little I think we were going the right direction because there was a bad guy. We gotta stay off. We're in like a big circuit board. Watch out! Whoa, yep. I don't know how far they can reach. I probably wanna go up that way. You can't go either way of those tentacle things. Okay. Oh, and here's like the third one of those. I think there's five of those. One for every side of a cog. And then on the fifth one, something happens. Whoa. There's another dead guy. Sneak in here. So that means another stamina thing. But it just adds more mystery too. Like what happened? Why are all these purple gooey? Ro the purple goo stuff seems to be taking over the world. This is some sort of electronic based world with cogs and metal. For some reason, parts purple goo move. taking over the world is a very common. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Why, does, why do they always have to use purple? Hmm. Yeah. That's a dead end. Can they use red goo? So why don't you try going the other way? I saw the slow way? crack. This way. I didn't. Okay, I can try to go to the crack. crack. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that crack. Just don't touch any of the red stuff. Okay, that way. Another dead end? No, wait a minute. That Clearly, this goo stuff is. Evil. Taking over the electronics or whatever. Yeah. Hey, I'm going on the dead tree. There's some guy. That's just an animal. I don't have to kill it. I can if I want. Oh, he's like. It doesn't give Wait, you anything. Wait, is that the black guy that was on? That was well, oh. I just killed that one back. I was trying. Oh, you killed him. He's a little birdie. No, he wasn't a birdie. Exactly. No, does that look like a bird to you? He doesn't have wings. Well, he's got two legs like a chicken. Okay, it doesn't look like a chicken either. <laughs> hey, treasure chest! 
I'm leaving uh, some light things back there. How did I miss those? There, back to full health. That's good. There's What's he another eating? Grass? Oh, thought maybe he was eating the leftovers of some other guy. In the tree. All right, so let's see what else can another I do. puzzle with those things. Yeah, I probably have to go up there or jump down, jump across, or walk across. Yeah. So yeah, yeah, you're right. That's um, I need to put one in there, don't I? And the other to one turn looks it on. like it would be across this weird bridge. Be careful! Don't fall. Look at all the purple stuff over there. Jeez, this purple stuff is really taking over the world. What's this? Glare. Power source. Yep. <laughs> Where? Oh, that's the thing! I know. Bring it back. Whoa, what happened? What? You... I, I fell and it blew up or did it? All right, so I don't know if I made it blow up or if it's on the time limit. Oh, Remember if it's those, on a time limit, that would suck. Like, like the barrels in Skylanders, right? Mm -hmm. The bomb barrel. The, yeah, the TNT. This isn't bucket. some sort of bomb. Let's see. I can just hold on to it for a while and see if it happens again. Or should I go for it? Go for it. What if I fall? Can I throw it? Drop it? Okay, so I can drop it. So maybe I just drop, drop it. Drop it makes it a spell, I guess. Yep. It doesn't do any... Oops. Yeah, electronics are weird. Well, at least, yeah. Oh man, that walking is kind of hard. Like, Spend, no, it's hard when it's, you're on giant places. It's it's just um, you gotta stay on that thin area, but the camera doesn't change. It's you can't spin around, right? So you have to move it. Mm -hmm. All right, so this is the first time I've opened one of these. It's a Hey, it's another one of those swirly balls. And watch what it does. The world moves. I guess you're going to have to go back up there. Yep. I like this game so far because of how, pu like, it's puzzly, but not, oh. but not too hard. Not too puzzly. This is the first time I've had problems with the walking. All right, so now this is here. This wasn't accessible before. And it's another one of those. Yeah, so Jesus. this just helps me get back to this part again sooner. Punch down. I see it creates... A ladder! A ladder. Now, maybe I need to go down there, or maybe I don't. Um, oh. Can I get another... Well, good thing when you do fall off it, his arm will catch on. I wonder if I can get another one. Nope, it's a one use. Once I used it, it's empty, so... But yeah, I can see a way. You jump off, you go in that, oh, that's a dead end. Why can't I fall off of that? Jump. I'm not going up. It's it's climbing up on its own. Oh, oh I died. Take fall damage, I guess. I guess there's a hefty fall damage. I've not tried to fall from so far before. I'm so high. Well, such a far distance. Um, I, is there a teleporter back there? We're back in the beginning of this area, which... Good thing I made that... Uh, ladder show up before she's back up there, but... Alright, so that's still blocked. I don't think this is still off. Ladder show. Do I have to do it all over again, or? It should be on still. The part that I turned on. I just had to find where that was. Nope, not that way. Attack early, attack off. It stuck. That's Elias' method of attack right there. What? Spam clicking. Sometimes oh, I got hit. you need a spam click. I know. Sometimes it's just the like quickest way to do something. 
Like, yeah, cause, like... Oh, see that? There, I wish I... Well, it's okay. We gotta find that area we were in. electricity I think okay so this is what we just turned on right yes and now I guess I should not <laughs> fall again because I will hurt myself and a power thing yeah we want to follow the follow power right the power hey no that one light up which makes this power light up which leads to this do I have to go underneath again maybe Yeah, that was where the dead guy was, I think. Yep. Nothing else that way. Uh. Jump in there. I don't really, I really want to see. I will die. I'm not jumping in there. I think it's fairly obvious I will die. Yep. It's all that. So I think I mean... this just came on. We have to go down there and figure out what happened. But the only way to go down there is that place. Unless you guys saw another path jumping across something like this way, maybe, right? Nope. Let's go that way. Then you could double jump. Well, maybe you can someday. This is one of those games that give you the abilities like that slowly, right? Or you have to buy them. So that very possibly could be something that happens in the future. Dad, if you um get hit by it again, like the. Purple stuff? Will your other arm come off? I don't think so because that was kind of, it was almost a cutscene. Alright, so, well, we did this, right? Yes. We didn't go down it. Battle Arena. Those are kind of, these are kind of like the unescapable battle arena fights in Skyline. It's not an arena. Well, that, that thing just killed one of the enemies for you. It got hit by lightning. Yeah, by the thing. Those things help. Maybe we got too close. Maybe it's your team. A punching. All right. Thing. That's the one I wish I would have done before I died there. Okay, we can go across. Or what's down here? Whoa, I got too close. Got that. And that we've been to there, so that's not anything worth dropping down for. See, it's not, it got the bad guys, but it's not helping me, it's just electricity. Ooh. This is what yeah, I saw that. before. Yeah, me too. Oh. That this lit up? I'm like, why, no, the why place. is there a bridge there? Does this mean I can do something here? It doesn't say I can, but. Go with it? Who's that? I can go in it, but... Do you... Oh. I was gonna read it. So using your glove abilities expands energy. Alright, so we got some... See, this one's off. I think it's getting dark. Yep, gotta do it in the shadows. That's a little weird. Gotta be careful. Hey, it looks like underground laboratory. Yeah. Now, see, I, I assume that's not a hole. Yeah, because if that was a hole, I couldn't see it. Sometimes I wish I could spin the camera around still, but... Like, straight past, you wouldn't spin the camera around? Like other games, you have camera control. This game, you don't. Yeah, like Minecraft, Portal Knights. That'd be funny mm -hmm. playing Minecraft with me. Now this looks like at some point it's gonna come together, but for now it's not, so I have to... Oh! I need to jump. Ah! Oh, I'm getting uh, frustrated now. Alright, saved it when I came in. So there is a lot of platforming in this game, obviously. I think I saw the way to go. I don't think you're supposed to go there yet. I saw another 
You saw what? Another way you could go. Which way? From here? There's no other way. No, not from there. From where you were. Oh, well, maybe, yeah. There isn't... There's a lot of times there's only one way through, like, the puzzle areas, but then there's an overworld area where you can go different directions. You see, you could fall down there. No, I would die, remember? Fall damage. I didn't fall nearly that far before. I could find a ladder somewhere to go down there. But no, they want you to jump. And there's also, you see some hitching right there. There's a little bit of hiccups. And the D-pad doesn't work, so I can't use the D-pad to make sure I'm going directly to the left instead of diagonal like last time. So hopefully I won't die. Oh, what happened? I did it again. I swear I was, I was walking to the left. Hmm. No, I have no problem doing this one. So this game has some control issues. Well, it just came out today. What do you expect? You never expect a game to have control issues, because that's not something they fix just because it came out today. So I expect a game that works. That's what I expect. I'm not saying this game doesn't work. It works yeah, fine. It's, it's just, working. it's not going to change either. This is the way it is. But you just have to be careful. And I don't know, maybe there's something about this part that I'm missing. I wonder, wonder, I want to wonder, I, I wonder why the game's called Hob. Well, yeah, it's part of the mystery, I guess. Maybe you are a Hob. Or maybe you're a robot that loves a Hob. Oh, barely made it that time. Is there a ladder to go? I don't know, understand what, maybe it's my controller. I'm gonna try a different controller. See why it jumps, like, up and down so much. So, what console is this game on? This is on the PS4. Now look, once I drop down here, I can't go back up. And there's a save point. Because I'm stuck here now until I figure out the way out. Figure out the way out. Yeah. It's, it's kind of like a dungeon. Oh, wait, you didn't save. No, you don't have to save it. it Weird it, flower It'll save creatures. automatically. Oh, I've seen them. They're easy. I don't know if they're bad guys, but get rid of them. They kind of look like rats. Did I go this way? Oh, yeah, that's the way. I came. Dungeon rats. So here's a door I can't get through. I'm thinking one of these days my glove gets upgraded and I can lift up some of these grates, but maybe not. Another rat thing. That's pretty. Whoa. Oh, so this I found before too. It, you put your arm in it. I don't know if it gets bigger or what. Let's see what happens. I think it gets upgraded. See, that must hurt. See, it added like a piece. Oh, maybe this game's a little like knack too. Just get bigger and bigger. So, did it get longer? Stuff is happening. I know it's good, but I think all it did was open the doors. What's that weird symbol mean? And this one here? No, there was one in the bottom left corner. Oh, I think that might have been a saving right. that's the saving symbol. Oh. It just saved the game. Now did I see creatures walk out that door? No, it was weird black puffs. Yeah, I thought it was creatures, I guess not. Have you seen this? Nope. I don't know what this is either. Switch. Oh, those are bats. Okay. I just lowered a platform. Really dark, really thin. Great. This means you have to move slowly. This one's on now. Whoa! Ooh. Wait, can you walk on that? Apparently can, but I'm not going to right now. Okay, nothing down here, so no. Oh, wait. Have I been here before? Is this the beginning? Uh. Yeah, that's the beginning, right? I don't know. No, it's not. 
Well, hmm. I don't know which way I should be going. That's one of those things I always struggle with. Sometimes you go a little further and you find like a treasure chest, right? Uh huh. Sometimes this may be the way I'm supposed to go. And this other thing up here went to a treasure chest. So let's go up here and see what this does. R1 button. Whoa, it's a telepad. That's what awesome. it meant. It doesn't give me the option to this time. Yeah, I'll just teleport you straight in a wall. So now I don't know. Did I miss something? Okay, so now here's another puzzle. This is a lot like Skylanders too. There was a part where we had to move. Platforms? Okay, so that's why it oh. didn't work. Oh, it's not. Okay, well, can I do it again? Nope. Alright, so now we can. This game is filled with mystery. It's just. It's a puzzle based adventure game, I would say. So you're constantly solving puzzles, fighting some enemies, and trying to figure out stuff. Here a clock. Yep. That means I'm gonna stay right here. <laughs> so I didn't do it in time. That is a time challenge. That's what the clock meant. Yep. Go. If you hear ticking, you better go. Is that do I go up here? I don't even know. Yeah, go up here, that's a telepath. I can't go up it. What is going on? Not I was climbing down. up. I didn't die. Where am I? Now I died. I think I grabbed on. I don't know. I think you have the extra part under it. I find the camera controls or lack of camera controls very uh, annoying. But it's still fun. It's just going to cause you to die sometimes. The good thing about it is that usually, so far, I mean, this one isn't too bad, but the save points aren't too far away. Okay, I gotta walk and stay on the little dark thing I can't see. Yeah, I hate it when games put that in. A dark path, a thin Now, do you want me to go this way, or do you want me to continue exploring the other way? Continue exploring the other way. This way? Yeah, because I've explored, like, ways they don't... That they don't think you'll explore before and got massive upgrades before. Well, it's not that they don't think you will, they just. Is that something climb up? Nope. Hitting that. Hitting that uh, ladder on the side of the pillar Robin is robot. hard. Yeah, see? I, so I turned around right before I got to what I thought it was. Because I didn't know which way was the Correct way. normal path to go. Another one of those blue things. Yep. Only need two more to upgrade your stamina. Which means more punch and power. I guess. I'll assume, I'll I don't know what it means. assume you'll need it for other things too. You, yeah. I haven't punched any enemies yet. I guess I could try that. It's a little hard to aim. Whoa, now it just does it in one straight line. Because they're all connected. So you need, there's a ladder on the side of there. I know, but it's hard to get on. Like, am I on it? Am I not? I'm trying to go up. Now, there I am. It's, just, it's just, Come on. It's very annoying. So you don't like the camera. Um, I mean, in this situation, you're pressing against the ladder thinking you should start to go up, and then you press up, and the first time it jumped me off, and this time, it didn't do anything. Okay, now I'm going up. Now! Okay, so... I wish you could sprint. And, and you also have to hit the yes, button, R1 button, when it says you can. Yeah, maybe you can. Maybe I'm not sprinting. I could jump into it or jump even once I'm on it. No. There you go. What? 
Are you supposed to jump across or go down? Go down. Well, this You're is going down. We're done. This is how we got here. But yeah, going down is. We should be done. I wonder what that did. Well, hopefully it turned something on, right? Or another one of these, yeah. So this is basically a Zelda dungeon. Uh, yeah, it's a little bit like it's got the same basic concept, concept and feeling. Okay, now we're at the lake. You, those guys are still so adorable. Those guys? Yes. They look like they're, they're all either the helping box. you or stealing it. Yeah, hard to say. And now that these things are on, it opens up more of the world. And we have a save point because Wait, I just more went mechanical arm thing. somewhere. No, I, I know what this will do. Let's turn it off. I know. Do I want to turn it off? Yeah, so you can get back. I mean, I guess I did, but. Oh, was that on a timer too? No, the thing turned on the ball. Yeah. <coughs> see the ball? That's right. Now I can do something with it, see? Mm -hmm. Oh, you can rise it. <gasps> OMG! Wow, I can walk it. Now where should I walk it to? Kill all the enemies. Kill all the enemies? <coughs> Lice is not walking on anything. I actually can't take it that far. I want you to so try where do to I need to go? There. I need to take it to a place. I, it won't let me go. No, in there. I think it wants you to go where where that electrical gate was. What electrical gate? That you just opened. I think it wants you to take it through that. walk on those things without hurting you. I guess so. Did it do anything to it or? Nope. We need another spot like the one I had to put it down on probably. Like this one. That looks like the same thing, right? Oh, those cats are running. Try to step on it. Is working. Oh, it did work. Yes. <laughs> I squished him. That way I don't have to fight him later, right? Look at that. I like this thing. It's like my very own. Fire. Park right here. Got him. No, it needs to be parked same type of thing it was, like right here. And that is going to turn this one on. But that power cord is on. This power cord is on now. Whoa, look, it's a factory. What did I just do? The map race. And I know, but I hit a, I pulled the lever too, so oh. now it's changing all around. You're in a factory, a gigantic factory. It's not a factory. What is it, Lice? It's like some t sort of lab. Like a lab? Oh, maybe. Mm -hmm. All right, so let's see. Where are we now? Wait, where's that point that guys? Oh, we're getting close to it. It's right north of us. That's where we need to go. Okay then. Alright, so are we there? Or where are we going? To the giant factory? 
Do I have to go down? Do I go around? Finding out where to go is always easy. Oh, this this is uh, the heart one. Oh. So I stick my sword in there. Kind of pry it open. Like cut off its whatever that is. Tongue. Yeah, it looks like. And then squeeze it, and then boom. Half a heart spot. And one more, and I will get a, another I saw something. thing. Yeah, that, that, that green thing. That looks dangerous, but... Why are the only enemies that fighting those guys? The roly polies. That's just what it is right now. They're in the ground. There's gotta be a boss. They're like fight. beetles. I've already had several of those. Like, Wait. small boss fights. Like mini bosses. I also I don't know if cutting the grass will ever lead to anything. But so far it hasn't. What mini bosses have you bought? Just big giant guys protecting something? I don't know. I'm sure we'll find one here soon. Isn't that the place you park the car? Yep. But here, there's a ladder. That was not there to Telepad. Sometimes I think like Wait, this game's here. boring sometimes, but then I think it's interesting. Oh yeah? Yeah, like that one part. I was just here. Um, where you had to walk across those bridges and do the jump pads thing. Grab pad. Oh, here? Yeah. No, I don't think so. It's metal. It doesn't work on metal. You need a fist upgrade to break metal. Maybe. Can't fall down there without that. Nope, there's a ladder over there. So let's see. We have got to get over there somehow. Maybe climb back onto the car thing. Yeah, maybe off the other side. It's not called a car. You can call it whatever you want, Slice. I'm gonna call it. Alright, you call a spider, he calls a car. It doesn't matter. I'll call it a robot. The robot. It's a robot. I can... Let's go in this way. That's where you found the heart. Yeah, but is it a dead end? Nope. Ah, this, this way. way. Swap. This way. What are you dying for? I don't know. Uh oh. Like that boss? Kind of. Oh, he's a lightning guy! No, he's thinking his tongue. He is Whoa. a new guy. He's throwing out... Lightning! Some... Run! I knew there was some sort of lightning creature. Oh, but he can only stay on those pedestal things. Oh, it's creepy! Uh oh, he's gearing up for something. That. Stay away, stay Run. away. Run. I should not run, okay? Never Running is run. not the answer in most of these games. They want you to fight stuff. It wouldn't be a fun game unless you had fights. Okay, so you yeah, don't just no run from everything. This isn't Minecraft, okay? Oh, I think he he's, spawns in enemies. Yeah, he's causing me all kinds of problems. He needs to come back down here. I found his cycle. It's there, there, there. Fight. Oh, he got me. Oh, not good. I only have one left. Oh, look. If I kill the little guys, I get the hearts. A now, boss. Yeah, do I need to beat him? What do I get? I don't know. I have no idea, right? Mm -hmm. That's why you beat him. Wait, he's going to that one! He changed. How you made his lightning bolts hit the Oh, that guy doesn't have any eyeballs. I know, he's only a mouse. 
Got him. Yes. I think. Yeah, there he is. Alright. Only money. Come Only on, he's a money. mini boss. But maybe I can get through this area now. Like, go up here. Or go this way. He's kind of blocking me. Alright, well let's... Hmm. You need to go this Am way. Am I going further away or not? Oh, here's a little treasure. I think somewhere around here, you have to find one of those heart things. Oh, this is a sit-down spot, just so you can look at the world. Well, it looks like the next area you're going to be in, going into is some sort of relaxing forest. Maybe. Doesn't look like it has oh. any purple. There's parts that move. Hmm. Alright, let's go down here. Wait, do you need a robot? I think you punch down into it. That's like a robot resting place. No, buddy, you don't punch down into it unless it tells you or you've already done it before. I think we should try going the other way. This one? Maybe up the, there was another way. Yeah, that way. Up here? Mm -hmm. Did you do anything with that? No. Did you? I guess I could attack the guy from here. If I, yeah, I could have attacked him if he went up that way. Maybe you just have to fall. Alright. How are you going to get the car up there? I don't know. We need to go up. Wait, I see a direct path right next to it. You see, there's that weird thing there, and then there's a little way you can go. It seems to be high, though, right? We need to go up to get there. Which means take the robot. The robot can't go anywhere. before we just followed the power true but the power is down there there's a ladder going down there and do we need to get down there or do we need to go up to get down there this that's a robot parking place. I really thought you could punch down there. Honey, that's not the way the game has worked that's so the far. That's place where you can park okay? the robot. If they want you to punch down, they give you the X and triangle buttons. And that means you can punch down. Now, I don't know. I did this. I must be something to do with this. Although, that's just looking. But below, I wish this part keeps moving. You can probably jump down there. You cannot jump down. Remember when I died? Oh, yeah. I will die if I try to jump down there. If I had a ladder to go down. It's going up. It's not going up though. It's just moving. It goes down and then went up and then went back. Where it was before. You are. Are these turnable? No. What I do? You broke it. Well, there you go. We could do that. Break the other one. Maybe that would have been good when the guy was alive. I don't know. Because he seemed to be using those to move. So that I could kind of punch. I just attack it. I don't think destroying him is going to turn on anything, but hey, we got to try. Are you going to just try all three of them? Yep. Maybe there's some sort of energy source blocking something. 
I'm guessing it was for the back, the boss. And right now it's not doing us any good, but yeah, see, it didn't seem to do anything. Well, worth a shot. Was worth a shot. Now maybe oh, I got light it. Maybe I can bust that. See how the camera has to give you a peek through the trees. Mm. All right, maybe we did everything over here. You sure we turned that on, right? Mm -hmm. And what did that do? Oh, did it open the door up over there? Hmm. Maybe I do need to move the car. And it looks like there's something over there, so let's try this. Although I'm not sure if I can stop it anywhere. Stop it here. It's like Donkey Kong. <laughs> it is that. like Donkey Kong. Where he jumps through ladders or vines. Well, now we know how to get up. We solved the problem of going up. And you okay, know. I jumped. Something big down there, too. That's a big guy? Well, it's no, one it's. Of those little you're right. Pulleys. It's kind of medium size. Normal size. Oh, I'm definitely gonna try my other controller because this feels very nerve wracking. All right, save point. Hey, look, you can see it. There's a giant building. Probably some sort of electric energy source. Yeah, but we, wanna, yeah. we might have a long way to go before we get there. That's probably like maybe some sort of beacon. Yeah. Well, this beacons are normally very important. I think this save point is a good place to stop this video. Um, what do you guys think about Hob? Good if you're like me, you like the adventure puzzle games. If you games. like puzzle games, like... Well, no, 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 no. I'm not asking what you... I'm asking you what you think. Don't tell me if you like. Tell good. me what you like. Do you like it or do you not? I like it. It's okay, but... It's okay? You're, you find it a little boring. Mm -hmm. Okay. So do you like puzzle-based games? No. No. Really. All right. So Elias, not a big puzzler. I get sports games. Elias does like the sports games. Connor does not. Connor likes the puzzle games. You like this one? Do you, yeah. So do you think not fighting things all the time and trying to figure out where to go and the jumping puzzles and what to do to get somewhere else? Do you think that's fun or boring? Well, it's boring until you realize you, what you can actually do with it. Like, that car thing was really, like, boring to get it. But then you could use it to get to these, all these the other places. Well, one other place. Maybe one other maybe place. two. Maybe more. The problem is you never really know, do you? Yeah. It's always like there's the obvious path, and then there's maybe another path. And sometimes, like, we walked around there for a couple minutes before I realized, hey, I could jump onto that ladder if I move the car over there, right? So nothing's going to tell you how to solve the puzzle. You can't go to an NPC character and be like, hey, what do I need to do? And they need to give you a riddle. There are no riddles. This is all like, visual-based puzzle solving, okay? It's about observing what's going on in the world and doing what comes to mind to maybe solve that right uh -huh. all right i like it i i like the puzzle games like this because they're not super easy and you question. don't have a lot of people telling you what to do so i kind of enjoy that um so i'm definitely going to keep playing this and if you guys want to play your own games you're more than welcome to or you can go back to some of the other games we've been playing question, though. oh well buddy um the lightning strikes and it doesn't make fire how's that the lightning strikes don't make fire? Yeah. Uh, nothing to catch on fire. It's a lot of metal and stone. Well, doesn't... If you touch metal that's been struck by lightning, doesn't it, like, shock you? It could, and I'm sure some parts of this game that would happen. Like, that sounds like a typical energy electric uh, danger area, right? Mm -hmm. Well, remember the grate we saw that we couldn't get through because it had the bolts or the electricity yeah. goes through mm -hmm. it. I bet sometime we turn that off and have to go back there. I think 
that's what that giant building we saw was for. Yeah, there's so there's lots of things. This game looks pretty big. I don't know how large it really is, but um, I'm gonna have fun with it. So I'm looking forward to it. It's a lot like Zelda. It's a lot of adventuring. It's just a little light on the combat. There's some combat, but it's not. It's more thoughtful combat, and more dangerous combat. Not a whole bunch of easy characters to just run through a lot. So. All right, well, that's going to wrap it up for us today. Thanks for joining us for another Skylander Nuts Presents. Let us know what you like about Hob. Do you like the adventure part? Do you like the platforming? Or maybe you're like Lias and think it's kind of boring. Um, let us know if you played it or if you want to play it and uh, what you think about the game. So until next time, this is Mike and the Boys with Skylander Nuts. Hoping you're having fun playing games, and we'll see you soon. Bye.